Hi, good afternoon. Welcome back to Pinoy Mom in the channel. So for today's topic, I'll teach you a very effective body scrub that you can just find it in your home, in your kitchen. So this will be the most effective. I think I will put it in a highly recommended item for all the mothers or men and ladies who's watching the channel right now. This is a very good type of body scrub, very natural. Uh, it's a very on a vegan type scrub. So all the vegetarian there who wants to have a very good um, organic type um, environment friendly body scrub this is a very good scrub for you so you can utilize your expenses also for the daily type of like you're not earning good but you still want to maintain your good looks still with a good skin this is a very good scrub so we'll begin now So we'll start preparing two ingredients. The first ingredient is a coconut oil or any kind of coconut oil, virgin coconut oil. So this one, I'm using this one, it's a brand here in India. So this is a parachute brand. It's a very good uh, brand for coconut oil because they have now two types of coconut oil. They have this aloe vera with uh, coconut oil with aloe vera and they have the classic one, the coconut oil, the plain. So now I'm, I'm using this, the coconut oil aloe vera for my hair, for my skin, especially from the stretch marks that I have after giving birth. And now I'm using this for this um, eco-friendly body scrub. So first is coconut oil and the second is tea tea powder, tea leaves, any kind of tea, green tea, black tea, any kind. Why this is a very economical body scrub? This is a very cheap body scrub because whatever tea you will use, you just keep it aside, open the tea bag, put that in a container like this plastic container or metal container and let it dry okay so once it open let it dry for maybe a, a 24 hour process or 12 hour process and once it dries completely this will be the next step add the coconut oil so along this video i will show you what kind of texture you want to see before you use the body scrub so after mixing the two things you need to prepare yourself like at least 15 minutes maximum 30 minutes before you take a bath so minimum 15 minutes or maximum 30 minutes before you take your bath you need to have this kind of consistency it's like a paste it's like a it's not a paste it's like a you know it's like a soil once the soil becomes moist and wet it will become like this so it's same with the tea tea powder tea leaves or tea any kinds of tea so green tea i recommend if you are drinking green tea much better because green tea is highly antioxidant for for the skin for the internal process for the external process everything is very good when you're using green tea but as, as of now i'm having black tea on my on my kitchen so i have only black tea so I'm recommending for all the people there, if you are not very into that kind of mixing things, oil and green tea or black tea powder, you can use the actual tea powder, okay? After you use the tea, open the tea bag. Of course, before you open it, wash it with normal water, rinse it with normal water. Once you rinse it with normal, wa normal water, the next step is open the bag you don't need to dry this is the good thing you don't need to dry okay it 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 will become like this 
once you open it will open like it's a scattered type now a little moist so directly apply that scrub that to your skin you don't need the oil if you are not that particular person that you don't want to mix things you don't want the oil in your skin you don't want that kind of a greasy feeling the best recommendation i can do is open the tea bag once you rinse it with normal water apply that in your skin skin circular motion like a scrub normal scrub without anything else and let it be at least 5 to 10 minutes. So once it applied to your skin, the, the kind of a, you know, the kind of feeling when you're using that as a scrub, it removes the first outer layer of the dead skin. Like our skin has a dead skin. That is the first layer, the dead skin. The dry skin, the dead skin. Those are the, the skin, the dead skin you want to remove on your head outer skin because it gives you that kind of a dry dull look so when you are exposed out to outside you are creating this kind of a very dry look dull look because all the pollutions all the kind of a dirt um, dust you are accumulating that on your face on your arms on your legs on your skin and also when you're sweating you're sweating it, it the sweats are sticking so it not, it's not helping our skin also to have that kind of a fresh look so now i'll show you how it's done okay first get a small drop maybe you can put that in your palm but i'm showing how it's how it will be done so get this much okay any amount and scrub that in your skin once you scrub but always scrub this in circular motion the oil what happened the coconut oil gives you a natural moisture effect like applying a lotion but this is a very natural okay so when you start doing this at least once in a week you will know that there is a good effect especially for the mothers because you know after giving birth we have this kind of a dry dull skin because all has been adjusted by our hormones so you can use this as a remedy for the dry skin problem at least if you have time once in a week but if you have plenty of time do it once i uh, know twice a week so this will be the good effect moisturizing your skin in a natural process and doing it in a very cheap way okay to be honest, it is much more good using natural products. If you have all the resources on your house, kitchen, pantry, so it's a very good way. So now see and see. You will see in the camera the effect. This is a lit this is on a moisture part and this is on a little dry part. This is, and this is, so see the effect, this is on, on a moisture part, and this is on a dry part. And take note, I already applied a lotion two hours ago, so the effect is different. And after leaving this in your skin, 15 to 30 minutes maximum, take a warm bath. Not a warm, like um, a very room temp bath, not cold also. So what you can do once you do your bath, normal bath, apply the, um, the normal soap you're using and always finish the bath time on a cold water. I'm always doing that to my hair, to my face, to the entire body. I'm always using a warm bath, then cold bath. What happens when you use a warm bath, you're opening your pores. 
you're opening the pores to clean it properly because all our pores is closed so what you will do you will have a warm bath from your head to butt uh, from your head to toes the whole body part and you're opening your pores so it will be more clean feel after that once you rinse your body just have a, a normal rinsing type um, use a cold water to close the pores because you are maintaining your skin in a moisture part in a very soft type so when you are having a warm bath to cold bath it locks the moist it locks the uh, the soft uh, feel in the skin so it helps also so that would be the best remedy for all the dry skins that is having hard time maintaining their skin not dry especially in the summer season these are best recommended also for the mothers or uh, people who are a very tight budget in the daily da daily type of like saving mode and all the people who just want to be eco-friendly environmental friendly who doesn't want to buy or to consume any kind of a commercial type product that is not good for the environment this is uh, this this uh, um, body scrub natural body scrub is a very good recommendation from from this um, channel from this Pinoy Mom India channel so try to try to use less harsh product that is not very complemented to your skin and to the um, season because it also affects the way your skin looks when when the season is winter you can try to use like more on the cold not cold like um, oil based product because it moisture your skin when the wind when the summer starts try to lessen the use of oil things in your hair if you're going outside and try to use a lotion that complements the weather outside like the 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 consistency that dries quickly these are the these are the 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 lotion that doesn't complement in summer season because it makes your skin dry so try to apply a lotion that's that's still moisture in a long process like five hours it's still moisture your skin because there are type of lotion that quickly dries and doesn't help your skin when you're outside so try to consume those kind of product to help your skin more looking young and vibrant and not um, uh, dull so because you want your skin looks looks more glowy young feel and especially smell good so these are the tips that i can give to you so if you're not still subscribed for this channel try to subscribe down below and you can do comment also for anything that concerning like you thinking about asking me something i just i would be very happy to answer that i, I will read all the comments if there's any comments below i will try to answer that and if you have any suggestion how to make this channel big as a big family you can suggest that also in the comment box and try to keep on watching for more updates and more videos upcoming soon Bye bye